Right here on the shore of Greer's Ferry Lake, look at the faces of these teen recruiters. By the way, a group that you're going to meet coming up in just a little bit on THV 11. But they're also going to be a part of our special THV in your town watermelon eating contest. Now, the big one is set for tomorrow as a part of the 30th cardboard boat races, which will be held here on Greer's Ferry Lake. But look at the intense expression on their faces. They are very competitive. This is going to be an exciting day. By the way, don't blame them at all for looking at the melon that way. That's a cave city melon. They don't make them any better anywhere in the United States. But Heber Springs is our choice for THV in your town. And by the way, this city holds the record as the most THV in your towns on THV 11. This, this I think, is our sixth visit here on THV 11. I also want to mention Mike, whose wife said I would never put him on TV. Is that right, Mike? Yes, sir. What's her name? Barbara Wooten. Barbara, if you're watching at home, I put him on TV, baby. I love you, baby. I'm <laughs> on. <laughs> it's all a celebration here on a beautiful, what has turned out to be a beautiful day. And if you want to find out more about those activities, you know where to go, THV11.com. But tomorrow, it's all about the cardboard boat races. Once again, we're with Jet and my team recruiters backing us up here as we take a look at Jet's boat. The theme tomorrow, Pixar. You are supposed to come out with a boat that's your favorite, uh, honoring your favorite Pixar character or Pixar movie. Of course, we have here the Incredibles Jet. Have you tested this thing? Do you know how fast this thing's going to go? Haven't tested it yet. We're going to find out in the morning. Are you excited? Are you going to be nervous tomorrow as you take this boat to the I've lake. got my nephews going to test the boat, or going <laughs> to use the boat, so we'll see how fast they can go. Teen recruiters, what do you think of the boat? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. I think this thing's going to win, don't you all? Let's have a big round of applause for Jet and his boat. I think this thing's going to win. Hey. Oh, Dawn, we got us a Cave City melon from Perky Wooldridge Farms, and we know how to use it because tomorrow, one of the big attractions for the cardboard boat races is the watermelon eating contest. John, you're going to be there tomorrow? You bet I'll be slicing a lot of watermelons tomorrow. How serious does this get? Tomorrow? Oh, man, I'll tell you what, they will eat the rinds sometimes. Yo. No, I'm serious. It gets crazy. It oh, is because it's, it's a Cave City melon. That's, that's right. They're good to last drop. All right, now I'm taking on the teen recruiters. Uh, this is their challenge, and Make sure it's make sure it's clean. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now, what are the rules? What do you do? All right, the rules are at this age group, no hands, guys. We're gonna say start. You guys eat all you possibly can until we say stop. Eat seeds and all. Okay. Don't stop. All right, all right, here we go. We only have so long on TV 11. We'll see how far we get. Crowd back behind the camera. Are you ready? Five, four, three, two, one, go. Who wins, John? Who, Who would you wins? say wins? Uh, you know, I think, wow. I think I think that was spectacular right there. <laughs> uh, uh, Ladies and gentlemen, what? I think Craig won. What? Thank you very much. Uh, yes, that's right, folks. On TV in your town, the fix was in. Although, looking at it, I would say Ryan and Jacob right here both. Let's have a big round of applause. And, folks, this has been a good year in Cave City. Oh, we are having a great time, and they'll have a terrific time tomorrow. As the cardboard boat races bring it all out of everybody. We'll be back. Hmm.